hello and welcome to my youtube channel canvas in this video we are going to discuss the conformation of cyclohexene oxide the planar structure of cyclohexene oxide can be drawn like this for better understanding label the ring carbon atoms as 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 here the six-membered and three-membered rings are cis-fused. Because of this, the four atoms C6, C1, C2 and C3 must lie more or less in the same plane like this. With the remaining two carbon atoms placed one above and one below that plane. This conformation is called half-chair conformation. Like cyclohexane, it can also undergo ring flipping to generate another half chair conformation with the same energy, where the position of four planar atoms remains the same, while the position of ring atom above the plane becomes below and vice versa. These two structures have enantiomeric relation. In cyclohexene oxide, the hydrogen atoms on C3, C4, C5 and C6 adopt two types of orientations like in the case of cyclohexane, but they are not quite oriented in the same way. These two orientations are called pseudo-axial and pseudo-equatorial. That's all in this video. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon if you like this video. Thank you very much for watching this video.